Hi and welcome back to my channel. Today I am vlogging from inside the UAE, my country of residence. I was gonna say my home country, but technically that's the UK. So yeah, where I live in Dubai, I'm doing a little staycay this week. It is the Eid holidays upcoming, so we've all got some time off work, which is lovely. And instead of traveling abroad this time, we've decided to enjoy where we live while the weather is still amazing. We have come to Sharjah, which is a another part of the UAE. It's another one of the seven Emirates. It's about 45 minutes from Dubai. We've just driven out here and we're staying at the Misk Moon Retreat, which guys, I'm going to show you. It's incredible. We've just checked into our room and we are very, very impressed. Oh, there's a fly. I'm being attacked. I'm going to start this video with a little room tour, but we're going to start from outside the room to give you the full effect of where we're staying. So we're staying in these moon bubble tents. As you can see, there's quite a few of them. This is the front of the tent. We have this amazing view. And then on this side of the deck, we've got like some patio furniture and then this barbecue station at the back. So we're gonna have our own barbecue this evening. And this is our, this is our view. So we're totally private. I'm jumping straight in this pool in a minute. It's super warm. And then I'm gonna take you inside. Here's our entrance hall. So we've got like all of our coffee things here. This is a fridge, not investigated what's in there yet. We've got a modern, I think this is the shower. Oh, this is the toilet. So we've got like a modern bathroom area. And I think this will be the shower, which, oh, I like the tiling, that's cute. Oh, it's literally just like one big wet room shower. It's super clean. And this is our bedroom area. So this is our view. I'm gonna lay on the bed, show you the view from the bed. Oh. So this is my view from the bed, not bad. And then the room in here, obviously we've just got AC. It's all quilted and just the bed with some bedside cabinets. So that's our room tour. I am going to sort some of our mess out. <laughs> I'm sure you saw it as you came in. And yeah, let's, uh, let's go and relax in that pool, I think. We are just having some alcohol-free beverages. Cheers. Another fun fact about Sharjah is that it's actually a dry emirate, so you cannot drink at all in Sharjah. There's no bars, there's nowhere that serves alcohol, not even in the hotels, which works out pretty well for me. We've just been chilling by the pool this afternoon. It's quite windy today, but it's been nice. It's got a little bit overcast, but also still pleasant can't believe how good this weather is considering it's nearly the end of April. Usually it's so hot. We've been very lucky this year. So our dinner has arrived. We have pre-ordered like a barbecue dinner. <laughs> um, it, you cook it yourself but they deliver all the food and everything to you and as you can see we've got like this little barbecue station and he's just setting up the barbecue here at the minute but i just wanted to show you what we got because it's actually really impressive um i'm so impressed so i just wanted to show you what was in here so we have like a bag of bread lovely this is our cool box with all of our meat and things so it's all marinated we've got like some chicken and some prawns veggies all that kind of thing thank you assistant and then we've got this, which is obviously for the bread and things, hummus, um, what are these called? The little vine leaves, stuffed vine leaves. I think this looks like dessert. Um, some rice and just like some really good stuff to go with everything. It looks so delicious. Oh, look at this. We have got some mussels. We've got some salmon. We've got some prawns, calamari, meat, veggies, it's all going on. Thank you, chef. Chef is, chef is busy working. Focused. 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 This is the final dish. We've got all of our 
hummus, mutbol, rice, spreads. Happy? It's very. Mm. We finished dinner. I just wanted to show you how cute this place looks in the dark because all the lights are coming on and it's so pretty. So the pool is all lit up. Our little tent is lit up. We've got all these cute little lights out on the decking. It's so pretty. See, it's not quite dark yet, but it is pretty much. And then this is the resort in the night. Isn't it just so cute? We're gonna head this way now for some evening entertainment. So we weren't sure if we were the only people at this resort because one, it's a Monday night and the, I mean, we've seen no other people. And we've come down to the communal barbecue bonfire area and Dan thinks that there is just us two here because they've only put two chairs out. <laughs> We have been brought to lovely little hot chocolates. morning morning it's about 6 30 in the morning and we are up there's not really a sunrise today because it's a little bit overcast but it is so nice and cool and there's a couple of hiking trails around the resort so we're just gonna go and check one of those out Dan's just emptying some sand out of his shoes so I thought I would catch you up on last night so we went to this like communal area. They put a movie on for us. So we watched Top Gun 2 and they brought us marshmallows, corn on the cob, sweet potato, and we could, and these like really big tong things so we could roast everything on the bonfire. They kept offering us karak, hot chocolate, water. It was so lovely. Honestly, it was such a good evening. Usually <laughs> me and Dan will just go to bed at like eight o'clock on staycase because we really do use this time to rest. But we, yeah, we stayed, we watched the whole film. Like it was just lovely. It was really good. We've just started this hike. So we're literally just like, the resort is there. And the security guard was really nice and was like, oh, I'll show you to the trail. So he brought us out here and then just started like scaling this mountain. <laughs> which if you're a little bit more adventurous than me, I'm sure we'll have an amazing view at the top, but um, I'm not sure I wanna just randomly walk up the side of a mountain at 6.30 in the morning. So we've come back down, we're gonna um, just stick to the paths, which I think is gonna be more appropriate for our level. And um, I think there's some camels over there, so we're gonna go see the camels as well. But yeah, just uh, if you do come here, you can scale that mountain apparently. back from our hike and breakfast has just arrived and it looks amazing. So we've got our barbecue station set up again. The guy just came and lit it all for us. We have got uh, some condiments and things. This is a bag of Arabic bread and toast. This is a whole bag of croissants. So many croissants, so good. We've got some milk. We've got some yogurts. We've got some orange juice. We've got some choco pops because we're five. Oh, we've got some eggs. And in here, oh my goodness, we've got baked beans, some like turkey ham. I'm guessing this is a fruit salad and probably yogurt. This looks amazing. So with the food, we pre-ordered what we wanted. So they sent us a breakfast menu. We had breakfast included with our room, but some of the rooms do come without breakfast. Um, and then for dinner, you can either bring your own food in or you can pre-order it. So that barbecue we had last night, we pre-ordered. There was different options of like only seafood, only chicken. We got the mixed grill. I think it was 395, 375 or 395. 
for two of us. I think it was like 375 or 395 dirhams and um, that included everything. So the guy that came to set it up um, and then the same this morning <laughs> with the breakfast, we've got a cat. <laughs> Yeah, so then the same with breakfast, he's obviously brought it all, set up our barbecue and everything. This was included in the price of our room. And to be honest, like there's so much food, like we're definitely not going hungry here. I'm sad because we have to leave. I have had, we have had, probably one of the best staycays that we've had in the UAE for a long, long time. It was so good. The service here is incredible. These guys cannot do enough for you, constantly checking on you. It's super easy to communicate with them through WhatsApp. Yeah, I would come back here in a heartbeat. The center is gonna close for the summer because it's just too hot and I believe they reopen October in 2023. So if you are looking for somewhere to stay next winter, put this number one on your list. It was incredible. We'll definitely be back next year. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you in the next video. Like, subscribe, and I will see you guys soon. Thanks, bye.